Hello! Welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video we will be looking at what is an overweight landing, when is it executed, and some other options that can be considered. What is an overweight landing? During landing, if the aircraft's total weight is more than the maximum design landing weight, it is called an overweight landing. When is an overweight landing performed? During normal aircraft operations, when an aircraft lands, its weight should be less than the maximum landing weight. However, in a few abnormal situations that trigger immediately after takeoff, like for example engine failure, hydraulic loss or fire, an overweight landing may have to be performed. Let's look at different aspects of an overweight landing Aspects of an overweight landing Safety Depending on the severity of the failure, the aircraft may have to return to the airport it took off from or divert to an alternate airport. An overweight landing affects an aircraft's performance margins and may even result in a runway excursion. Aircraft Structure in an overweight landing, the aircraft weight is more than the design landing weight. The aircraft's landing gear must be designed to withstand heavy landing loads. The landing gear structure should be able to absorb and handle the aircraft weight during an overweight landing. Aircraft Performance the landing performance information for an overweight landing will be available in the manufacturer's documents. This information is required for brake energy management and computing the runway length requirements for this type of landing. Automatic landing. The auto land feature available in modern aircraft is designed for aircraft landing within the maximum landing weight. In case of an overweight landing, a manual landing should be preferred. Maintenance checks. After an overweight landing, maintenance checks are to be performed and necessary repairs have to be carried out. Now let's look at some options other than an overweight landing and will they be considered after a failure in flight? Options to avoid overweight landing. Depending on the failure in the aircraft, there are other options that can be considered to avoid an overweight landing. Fuel burn. Here, the aircraft would enter a holding pattern to burn fuel. This will reduce the weight of the aircraft. The weight can be brought below the maximum landing weight. This option consumes a lot of time. Fuel jettison. This is also known as fuel dumping. Here, the fuel is dumped overboard via jettison pipes. This option takes less time than burning fuel, however, it can impact other aircraft or people on ground. Fuel jettison must be done when flying higher than 6,000 feet. At these levels, the fuel will evaporate before it reaches the ground. In these options, time and aircraft performance become a crucial factor. Flying for longer times in a hold pattern for burning the fuel can cause the situation to degrade further. For safe fuel jettison, the aircraft may have to climb higher to dump the fuel. So depending on the severity of the failure in the aircraft and the time availability, all the options must be evaluated and the safest option must be executed. That's all for my video on an aircraft's overweight landing and other options. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please share and subscribe.
and you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.